All right, we've got a, a walk around today of a, a Kawasaki Bayou 220. Um, it's a, a four-wheeler, uh, two-wheel drive. It's a utility. Um, so I'll just go around and explain a little bit about it. Uh, I just cleaned it up, by the way, and it looks really nice. It's a, a 99 model, 1999. Um, it's a 220cc engine. It's actually like 219, but basically, you know, they round up or whatever. Um, it's got two front lights, uh, two back lights, two tail lights. Um, so I'll just go into a little more depth. There's a hitch right there. It's not a chain driven, it's hydraulically driven, which is hydrostatic driven. Um, you get your brakes down there. Um, these tires are pretty worn down, um, not terrible, but I do a lot of cement, like driving on the asphalt and cement, because I don't have the most place to ride at my house. But I do a lot of driving just on the ground and so my treads are getting kinda low. I'm gonna buy some new tires for it in the next couple weeks or months. Um, I cleaned it up and I did all the plastics cleaned up and the seat and everything and I did the wheels. The wheels look really nice. The only thing I didn't do is the uh, inside of the rim and the little like um, the caps there. Um, I didn't do those. So I'll just show you. It's a uh, manual. Well, it's actually semi-auto. But it's a five-speed semi-auto with reverse. Um, you have a pull start right there, and you have your uh, shifter. Um, on the other side, you have your brake and your oil. Um, there's more of the tires. Over here is your ignition switch, right here. On the other side is your reverse. Now, to access the reverse, all you do is you turn this knob towards you and you press down on the shifter and it goes right into reverse really easy on this handlebars you have your uh, off and run switch your start button your choke and your uh, light the low and high beams also you have your front brake which is like a double lock um, you hear how it double clicked and you, you it's a parking brake so you pull in like that um, I believe that is the back brake over the, the left handlebar and, and this is the front right here. Um, so this is the front brake I think and that's the back. It's confusing because usually the right's always the front but I don't know how they, they did it differently. So that's the whole thing right there. Um, I'll, I'll start it up real quick for you guys. I'll start it up for you guys real quick and I'll show you guys how it runs. Alright so let me get on real quick. Uh, so you just turn the ignition, that puts it in neutral, it only starts in neutral, the light goes on, you know, put your button over, and uh, just click a little bit and it'll go, and sometimes and if it's in the cold, you know, you either use a choke or you just give it a little throttle, and it starts right up, it starts really nice, and there's your fuel gauge right there, and your fuel cap, I gotta get a new new hose, it's kind of a uh, crack there, but they're really cheap on ba bikebandit.com, it's a good place to get your uh, equipment and bikes for like parts for every model and stuff. Um, so I might just drive around a tiny bit real quick to show you guys. So you just you just shift up once to go on first and you know it goes. There it is. Shift shift up again to go to second. Again to go to third. third gear uh, coming back. It's a pretty nice bike. Um, it runs pretty well. Um, I'll show you the reverse real quick. So you got a downshift. You gotta go all the way to neutral. Go all the way to neutral. And then what you do is all you do is turn this knob towards you and press down with your foot at the same time and it goes the red light comes on and it takes reverse. And there you go backwards. Um, so then, and then just to go back to if you go to go back all you do is just pull up. And if you pull up hard enough, it will kick right back into first. If you just do it like a half click, you'll go back to neutral. If you do a full click, you go to um, first actually, so that's pretty cool. And you know, just turn it off, you just either pr turn this button to off or you just turn the key. 
just turn the button like this, goes shuts right off. And um, just click it down to back to neutral. And the only way it does start, like I said, is neutral. You just turn off the key, like that. So yeah, this was a little review and a walk around of the Kawasaki Bayu 220. A uh, really nice sized four wheeler, and for the price you guys you can get it for these days, it's really worth it. So uh, thanks for watching, and uh, stay tuned for some more videos. Thanks.